Let's say I want to update a policy for personally owned devices enrolled last year or earlier that are currently non-compliant. That's where multi-device query comes in. I'm at the all devices level in device query. And you can see there are cross device options for several different property categories here. And by expanding the device property set, I can see a ton of options for devices. So here I'm going to type the query device, then I'll add a condition for enrolled date time using this where clause to find devices enrolled prior to this date. Now I'll type in another for personal device ownership and one more to find non-compliant devices. Let's go ahead and run it. And here I can see all of my results. You'll see that these span all OS platforms with Mac OS, Windows, Android, and iOS from a variety of manufacturers. Then if I scroll to the right, you can also see our enrolled date field. Then a bit over from there, we see the ownership and compliance info as queried as well.